organize your Google Drive and your folders so that you can move things in and out of folders and share things with people. Let's get into your Google Drive from your Gmail again. Here's your Gmail. Up here, you can see that it's your SQU Gmail, and we're gonna go into the nine dots to open up your drive. Here's my drive and I have lots of folders here and also lots of files. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to make a new folder so I can put some things into it. So I'm gonna to go to the top here and make sure that I'm in my drive, not shared drives and not shared with me. This is my drive for my things that I make. I'm going to click new and I'm going to choose folder. This is also how you make new files, but I want to make a new folder. I'm going to name my folder 340 screenshots study skills. This is where I'm going to put all of my calendar screenshots so that I can easily find them and put them into my portfolio. So I'll click create. And now I have this new folder you can see right here. If I click it and go inside of it, you can see there's nothing in here. I can make new things in here. I can click the plus button to add new documents um, or I can just go out go back out to my drive and I can find things I already have and move them there so let's do that let's go to my screenshots here inside my screenshots I have some things that I want to send to that I've got some of my Google Calendar things so I'm going to choose this I'm going to right click on it and with right click I am going to choose move to. I can do lots of other things with right click like share, I can uh, rename it, I can make a copy of it, but what I want to do is move it, move to. It's going to let me choose where I want to move it. So I'm going to choose the arrow to go back out to my main Google Drive. It says my drive and I'm going to find 340 screenshots study skills and click the arrow. This is my empty folder and I'm going to click move here and move. So this was my screenshots, but now one of them is missing. It's been moved. I'm going to go back to my drive. Here I can see my 340 screenshots folder and let's open and see if it's there. There it is. So now here inside of my drive, I can add other things if I want to put slides or docs or sheets or any of these other Google tools that I can add to this. Um, and I can also share this folder with people. So if I need to share this folder with my teacher here, I can go in at the top at the name and do share. Or if I'm back out in my drive, I can find that folder right here, 340 screenshots. I can right click. and share with right click. So there are two ways to share. One is inside by clicking on the name and then the other is out in your main drive and click share. So with share, I am going to need to type my teacher's name. Uh, Jennifer McCoy, that's me. Mm -hmm. Make sure you choose the right one. If you choose the wrong teacher, it will not go to your teacher. Message, hello, Ms. Jennifer. Here is my screenshot folder. Regards, student. Um, I'm adding my teacher as an editor and I'm gonna click send. This is gonna notify her. That means it's gonna send her an email that I'm doing this. If you don't notify people, it will it will be available to them. They can click in and look at it, but they have to go look for it. They don't know that it's in their in their drive and it will be in there shared with me. So I'm going to click send now. Now my folder is there. You can see I just got an email. It's told me that it's it's come to uh, send a notification to me. Um, here I can right click and make sure that it's shared correctly. I'm going to look and share and see. And it says done and yes, it's shared with me. So that's how you can organize your folders in Google Drive. You can put anything you want in a folder. Any of these items can go in your folder and you can share any of these that you want with your teacher or with other students. Um, right click is important because that's how you can choose how to rename it and to share it and to move it. That's it. Thank you.